These 10 free AI tools are gonna change your life. These are insanely useful. So let's jump right into this. Tool number one is depth.reflection.app. What this tool does is it's amazing. It gives you personalized journaling prompt. A lot of times, if you're like me and you're trying to journal, but you can't think of those prompts, well, this is the tool for you. So for example, let's say I'm feeling burned out after a long day of making videos. So put that here and then click on get your journal prompt and then sit back and it's gonna give you these prompts that you can sit and then journal on. So what's been your biggest challenge lately? What are three ways you can prioritize self-care this week? So you can use these prompts to really create your journal. So absolutely free, depth.reflection.app. And by the way, I'll have all the links below so you can check them out. And before we go to tool number two, make sure you like and share this video. Why? So more people can see this. All right, tool number two, it's tldrthis.com. This tool saves me so much time. This tool summarizes any piece of text. So, you know, if you're like me and you don't like reading long articles or long text that people send you, guess what? This tool is for you. So check this out. You can enter the long text here or just the URL of the article that you want to summarize. And there are a couple of things here. You can do key sentences or human-like summary. You can do short, concise, detail, display important keywords. You can play with these uh, settings and then click on summarize this and then sit back, relax. In just a few seconds, it's gonna create a summary. So this article was a couple of pages long. So let's look at, look at this. <laughs> so instead of spending like 10 minutes reading this article, I can spend like uh, 30 seconds or less than a minute to really get what this article is saying. So, and here you go. It's gonna, it also estimates how much time you're gonna save. It's gonna save me two minutes. Awesome. All right, AI tool number three, and you are gonna love this one, symptomchecker.io. It's AI-powered medical symptom checker. So let's input your age, uh, male. What's your main symptom? I'm just gonna say I have headache, and I'm gonna say I have bad headache, and it comes and goes. Obviously, you want to be more detailed, describe your symptom in detail, uh, any health uh, issues, so none, you can leave it empty, continue, social history. These are the questions that people ask you or doctors ask you when you go to their office, right? You can leave these empty for the purpose of this demo, and then look at this. So it's giving me here is what AI says about my symptoms. So cluster headaches, sinus headaches. So it's giving me all different uh, possibilities. Tension headache, this is the most common one. Migraine, so I can really, based on my initial symptoms, I can use AI to check those symptoms and give me detailed answers and detailed symptom checker. Obviously, for any medical condition, don't just rely on AI. You wanna go to your primary healthcare, your doctor, right? All right. Let's jump to tool number four. It's essay-builder.ai. It's gonna write essays for you. Essays, blogs, you name it. If you're a college student, it's gonna create essays for you. If you are a marketer or a business owner, you can use this to create content. So let's say I wanna write essay about history of Mexico for some reason. How many paragraphs do you want? Uh, you can select that. And what type of essay, classic, uh, critique, let's do a classic essay, and then generate your essay. And you'll notice in just a few seconds, actually, it already started. It's faster than me. <laughs> so here is the, the essay that I can use, and it's absolutely free. I can copy this text and use it. And like I said, you can write essays with this. Uh, you can also use it to write blog content, content for your marketing. All right, tool number five, it's perplexity.ai. This is kind of like ChatGPT, but in my opinion, it's much better. It's a chatbot, but it has, you can access using, uh, you can also use this to use uh, uh, GPT-4, not just GPT-3. Here are the popular searches, and I'll give you a demo in a second. So let's say uh, I wanna, how do I cook? Turkey, right? And it's gonna give me the answer and also it will hear all the 
adept to cook turkey but you'll notice it's going to give me all the resources that i used here are the resources and then here are follow-up questions that i can use how long should i cook the turkey per pound and it's going to give me 20 minutes per pound and also the temperature amazing right uh, it also launched ai profile so if you sign in create an account you can have your own profile and then your searches will be customized uh, based on your profile so the cool thing about this there are two things that i really like about this tool one obviously if you use login and use the copilot you can access gpt4 that's one number two is it can access the internet so for example who won the super bowl in 2023 uh, ChatGPT does not have internet access. You have to use plugins to be able to use the internet. But Perplexity has all the internet access. Look at this. So I got the answer. Kansas City Chiefs, February 12, 2023. And here are the sources, right? The other thing that's really cool about this uh, uh, chatbot is you can download this on iPhone and also Android. Uh, and then on iPhone, you can also use voice search. So you can search with your voice. Really, really awesome AI tool. All right, let's jump to the next one. Uh, tool number six, Casse DeSante. I think that's how you pronounce this. Don't, uh, <laughs> don't mind me, don't kill me if uh, this is not the right pronunciation. But what this does is there's a really cool AI tool which is new here, AI Meal Planner. So click on this and now uh, give your food preference and it will create a delicious meal plan for you. So let's say I want low fat and high protein diet, right? That's my restriction or that's my preference. Now click on run and then sit back, relax. It will create, so let me scroll down. Look at this. For Monday, it is my breakfast, uh, description, calorie range, for lunch, for dinner, for Tuesday, here you go, for Wednesday, same thing for breakfast. So awesome, right? So you don't have to think, you don't have to do uh, research. People used to spend a lot of time on Google and different sites to come up with this meal plan. Guess what? Now AI will do it for you. Uh, and then again, the site is called casedesante.com. And then if you click here, you're gonna go to the AI meal planner and then enter your preferences and it will create the meal plan for you. <laughs> Amazing. All right, tool number seven, it's called logicballs.com. Now this tool has a lot of different AI apps and uh, tools that you can use for marketing, for social media, uh, for business, product, uh, design, anything that, that you name it. So this is like a collection of a lot of different uh, AI tools. So for example, let's say uh, one of the things I like to do is keyword research. So whenever you are writing content, uh, so let's say my one of my primary keyword is I want to write something about productivity hacks So I'll click on generate and now based on that keyword It's gonna generate different keyword ideas for me. So to create content you can use these ideas So it's really uh, awesome if you are blog writer or if you create content now Let me show you another tool. So TikTok script generator. It can also generate scripts for your video so let's say a man telling three tips about TikTok marketing. So whatever your idea, your video idea uh, is, write that down here and then click on generate and you'll notice it will generate that script for you. And this tool is absolutely free. Obviously you're gonna have some ads pop <laughs> on the website, but guess what? It's free, so that's fine. So here is the, the full script. Here's tip number one, consistency. Tip number two, use trending hashtags. Tip number three, collaborate with other. Those are, those are actually really good. Uh, number one is kind of generic, but I think number two and three are really good. So you can create scripts for your video. So logicballs.com uh, and a lot of different uh, AI tools and apps that you can use. Email writer, uh, hashtag generator. So many awesome tools. All right. Let's jump to the next one. I think tool number seven now, or tool number eight actually. Uh, so it's called Image K 
Candy, imgcandy.com. So this is like an online image editor and there are a lot of different tools you can use so to your, uh, for your images. So you can convert images to PDF, you can watermark your images, you can rotate or add text. Uh, you can convert your images, you can uh, convert videos to GIFs. One of the things a lot of people do is they remove backgrounds from their images. So I'll show you that real quick. So let me go find an image. So let's say that image and I'm gonna upload uh, and in a few seconds, it's gonna do a magic and the background will be uh, removed from that image. Here you go, look at this, the background is removed. Uh, you can obviously download this and then use it in your project so anything it's a free online image editor and there are a bunch of tools that you can use to uh, play with your image imagecandy.com all right tool number nine and this is another one that saves me so much time you know people spend a lot of time reading news articles and news articles are long on uh, different websites uh, but guess what this AI tool or a website current.report, this is kind of summary of different news articles. So for example, here are, uh, you can, here's the recommended and then also here's the recent news. And this is the full summary, this is all. This is all you have to read. <laughs> so let me go back. So in my case, what I like to do is go to technology because that's my technology and business. Those are the two uh, of my areas. Let me refresh this. There you go. So technology, here's the Meta's Project 92, and I can get the whole picture about this article right here. Uh, and by the way, uh, here are the full, here are the sources. So you can also, if you want to read the, the full article, uh, you can also kind of go there. But uh, this, will, this tool will give you the news uh, summary that you can read and get a feel for whatever is going on in your niche technology business in just a matter of seconds. This saves you a lot of time. And yes, it has dark mode if you are a fan of dark mode. <laughs> All right, tool number 10, it's pdfcandy.com. So this tool has hundreds of tools, actually 47 tools, not hundreds of tools. <laughs> I take that back, I got excited. But different tools you can use on your PDF files. For example, you can compress, you can edit, you can merge, you can convert PDF to Word. Uh, one of the things I like to do is sometimes if I'm sending like PDF uh, plans, maybe sometimes I protect them, I add password to it. So I'll, I'll show you that tool. So let me go uh, and find a PDF file, so here's a PDF file, and let's say I want to add a password, protect, and now I can download this and that file, the PDF file, will have a password on it. It will be protected by a password. So pdfcandy.com, it has a lot of over 46 tools that you can use to edit, uh, convert, password protect or unpassword protect your uh, PDF files. Anything you can imagine to do with your PDF file, you can do it here. Now, if you guys have any questions about these AI tools, let me know in the comments below. Before you go, make sure you like and share this video so more people can see this. And now I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.